Hi. Uh, today we are discussing about union transmission. Union transmission is active and connected type of transmission. So already uh, I prepared one mapping here with the union. So here I took two sources. One is uh, AMP file and one is AMP table or actually. So here in this case the both sources have the same structure. So when the sources have the same structure then only we can use union to drag and drop all records into the target. So first we need to take the sources okay from repository navigator drag and drop the sources and target. Target also contain same structure because both the sources have the same structure. Okay, then go to transmission, create a new union transmission here. So here we have icons using union transmission icon also we can create the transmissions. So by default there is no columns here in union. We have one new group. First drag and drop the records drag and drop the columns from any source into union transmission. So then here we will get input ports and output ports. But if you want to connect with multiple sources then create multiple groups. So based on the groups you will get input ports so we can add multiple sources into the union transmission. So here C. So this is the flat file connection and this is Oracle input connections. So definitely we will get only one output ports because this is multiple inputs and single output. Okay. So from outputs we can drag and drop the columns into the target. Okay. So validate this mapping and C. So after this we need to create the workflow and session. Okay, the same way like other mappings. Here also we created one session. In this session, we change the connections. So this is the file. We mentioned the path here. In source file directory, C colon backslash. So in C directory, we have EMP file. The EMP Oracle table we took from Scott. This is the Scott connection and target. Now we are storing in the same, same C location with EMP file new. Okay, I'm changing this name. One, one. Okay. Just save it and start this workflow. So here in two sources we have 14 and 14 records. Total 28 records it will store in the target table. Total 28. So we can see the output here. Out file name is EMP file 11. So here we have total 28 records. So like this when the table structures are seen we can use union to pass the data into the single target. So union we can use on heterogeneous and homogeneous tables. Homogeneous and heterogeneous sources. So multiple sources we can union at a time using union transmission. Here union is active and connected type of transmission. Okay. So here we have to create the groups. Based on the groups we will get input port links. Thank you.